Oh, okay. Well, yeah. Uh, this is a, a haul video for stuff that I got before I went away on vacation to North Carolina, and it is it, it was multiple days, and it's it's quite a lot. So uh, for me, anyway. So um, I'm gonna just I'm gonna go, go ahead and just get started. I got this can of jar. I only got it for the lid. You know, I like to sell these, and it's a good thing I got it because apparently I had my my store was overloaded and or not overloaded but uh the ones that i had listed i must have had the number incorrect on because i thought i was sold out and then i sold another one so this is actually was actually the one that i needed so i'm glad that i picked that up but that was it was uh it was a buck 29 but it was actually clearanced out for 39 cents so i got it for 39 cents so that worked out for for that anyway so put that over there and then uh I'll show you some other. This is this is something that's called Marcrest, and it was actually two ninety nine. But I I have uh, I have what do you want to call it? A um, I have a weakness for Marcrest for some reason. Sometimes I just can't help but buy it. This was supposed to have a lid, and and I didn't and I knew that and I still bought it anyway. I don't I, I still can't figure out why I bought it, but I did. <laughs> I used to have I used to collect it for the kids and then. They didn't like it, so I sold all the stuff I had years ago, and I still just every once in a while I buy it. So I'll probably take that over to the shop and just try to get rid of it there. George R. R. Martin, it was 99 cents. I just grabbed it, Game of Thrones book. Uh, I ought to be able to get something for it. So it, I, I'm not going to put it online. I'm just going to take it to the shop and try to sell it. So. There's that. I might put it online, but it doesn't. I don't think it sells very well. So, all right. So, I just start with this bag and this stuff that's wrapped up. Lots of times I tell them at the store, don't wrap it. Just, just don't wrap it. All right. This is this is a. It is a Corning. Centura. Oops. There it is. Centura. Centura yeah. Centura. 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 But that's not very. There we go. That's not wasn't really being very, very kind when it comes to being. So there was one of the one, two. I think I got four of these, three. And she had some listed, and I said, ah, I said I'm not listed. She had some of them wrapped, and I said, ah, you don't have to wrap them. I think there's four of them, but I'm not sure where the other one is. Then I grabbed these. It says uh, a set of two. So it's just a cute, really cute little, these are like Lily of the Valley kind of looking things. So a uh, set of two for a buck. So I'm sure there's a, I actually bought this stuff and I, yeah, there's the, there's the, uh, I'll probably put, I'll probably put that over the shop and just put like $5.99 on it. I'm going to, if I can, I'm going to look it up. Elizabethan. Terrible lighting down here tonight. Terrible lighting. There we go. Elizabethan. I'll look it up and see. I didn't look it up when I bought it because I knew I could sell it at the shop for more than I paid. So that's all I was concerned about. All right. Put that there. I get these Corningware mugs out of the way. I used to sell a lot of that, that Corningware Centura. I don't know if I've been... I think this is the other one. I think this is the fourth one. Yep, it's the fourth one. So they they set a four for a dollar. So they're a quarter for a buck. So they're a quarter a piece. Yeah, you can. See. So, uh, yeah. So, so I mean, worst case scenario for a buck, I'll use them. They are cool. All right, and then I grab this. I wonder if that had a lid. You can see, just a piece of amber glass. It was a dollar. And uh, amber glass seems to be doing okay. So let's see if this is the lid. Yes, it's a lid for it. So we have a lid. So it's one of those. I mean, it, it if it doesn't sell online, I mean, somebody at the shop will buy it because amber glass are people are looking for it now, regardless of what uh, might be the word out there. People are looking for it. So I don't think there's a maker mark. I don't see a maker's mark, but. And I don't know if it's old or not, 
but uh, I'll look it up and see. I'll see if I can figure find something on it. I'll spend a little, not a lot of time researching it, but some. But amber does seem to be doing all right, so that color glass seems to seems to be selling. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna turn it away when it's cheap enough that I can just store it. These were a surprise. I don't know if you. Uh, French Bistro is the name on the bottom of it there. It's not old. Boy, the, the lighting in here is horrible tonight. I don't know why that is. Yes, cafe. I paid a buck ninety nine for it. And I actually have multiple. I have three three pieces, I think it is. No, is it two? Might be two. Might just be two. I think it's, I think it's just two. So that obviously is not the correct lid. This is the correct lid for it. Now you can look this stuff up, friend that French bistro. Um that that one doesn't I was I was shocked by what I saw, so it's got a little it's a little no nah, yeah, that'll come off. Whatever's on there's gonna come off. So yeah, French Bistro, American A T E L I E R. Uh they, there was a couple there was a couple that sold for like $145. I don't know if it was real or not, but um I paid two bucks for that one and three bucks for this one. So uh I I'm gonna I mean I'm gonna list mine for I'll list them for two I'm gonna list them at two uh, I mean not I'm gonna list them at I'll probably list them at one for one forty nine each and uh bring and come down on them after after a bit but I'm gonna I'm gonna try if that's I mean that was on this on the cell phone so who knows this is it's called Darwin compound uh, I kind of let it sit it looked like it was already in an antique shop they had 99 cents for it at the Goodwill I saw that little st sticker on there uh, it says pharmacy jar three bucks that might have been a yard sale sticker so anyway uh i looked that up and they, they were doing good too so um i i actually didn't get, grab it i looked at it and i left it because it it looked uh it looked kind of modern and so i just left it and then i thought well i'm just gonna i'm just gonna go i wasn't even gonna look it up and i did and i'm glad i did so um I don't remember what it was. This stuff was a week, week, week and a half, two weeks ago that I that I got this stuff. So it's it's slipping from my mind about you know how much stuff it's going for. And I grabbed this Doctor Heckle and Mr. Jide, v, Mr. Hyde, VHS tape. Uh, I couldn't find anything comps wise for it, but I'd never seen it, so I grabbed it because you just never know. All right. And then here's another bag. These these have been sitting in my Goodwill for a while. I should have probably waited to see if I could get them on clearance, but I didn't. I wasn't. I never looked them up, and then I finally did while I was there. They're just these little jiggers, little stuff for wiring, and. Uh, I finally did look them up, and and I was kind of uh, that 10 RC-8. I was kind of really, really surprised at what it looked like they were selling for. So, I mean, actually selling for. So, uh, I paid I paid four bucks a piece for for the boxes. So you can see they're three ninety nine. So, uh, if I paid four bucks for them, you must know that either. I Either somehow, somehow the eBay app tricked me, or they were worth quite a bit because I don't pay much for stuff typically, uh, especially stuff like that. I was just astonished. I was amazed. I remember being really surprised that that they sold for what they did. The app tricks me sometimes. I grabbed this strawberry shortcake cake glass because well, uh, it's old. It's uh, American Greetings. MCM that's 19 it's 1980 1980 on there so I don't know if they're any good right now but I just 
I grab it because all of those character glasses are selling at the shop pretty pretty well. There's you know it was this was 79 cents, so I can they're they're going like three, four, five, six bucks a piece. So they're all selling fairly well. This one was 79 cents for this Disney one, and uh, and all the Disney ones they all sell out pretty quickly at the shop. So. I may not take it over there, but I might. It just depends. If they're selling decent on eBay, I'll do that. But if they're not, then they're not. All right. So this is a fire. Well, it's Anchor Hawking. Seventy-nine cents for this mug, milk glass. And uh, yeah, it's a Fire King mug. Oh, I don't know if you can see that. I hate the lighting down here. I don't know why it's so atrocious. There, you can see Fire King on there. Anyway, uh, Hayo Siko with a Siko, Hayo Siko or Siko or whatever it is with a little mask there. I don't know what that even means. I couldn't find anything when I looked it up. Didn't try very hard when I bought it. I just bought it because it's Fire King with a thing like that on it. So it's probably all right. I don't think I'll lose money on it. Okay, what next? And this is just a piece of Pyrex. It's the Americana. It was a buck twenty-nine, just a little one, so I grabbed it. They don't sell very well at the shop. Those ones don't, but I bought it anyway. I have. It didn't have a lid with it, I don't think, but I, I have lids for them. And then this was. Oh, it's another Disney glass, and that was uh, seventy-nine cents again. Yep, there you go. You can see it's another Disney glass. So I'll just put that over here. All right, uh, I guess we'll start, I guess I'll start here with this. I get this big thing out of here. Oh, it's okay, it's just a, a carnival glass uh, goblet. Um, it's a buck. I got that at the yard sale. I got that at the yard sale shack. I got this there too. This was there. I don't know if they're any good or not. Um, it's not Diamond Point. I forget what that pattern's called right now. I can't remember it offhand. Uh, but uh, it is. Stuff comes around and goes around. The price was right, so uh, I grabbed it because. Well, the price was right. What you gonna do, you know? Uh, those goblets. I think that's the second one of those, that color that I have. So I'm gonna just... I'll probably just hold on to them until I have more. You don't find them very often, but I don't anyway. Alright, and then I grab this milk, milk bottle. It's Valley Farms, which is... Uh, it's... It's kind of big around this area. I don't know if this is any good or not, but I paid three bucks for it. So I'll take it over there. Probably, I'll look it up, but I'll probably just take it over to the shop and just put like five or six bucks on it. It's, it doesn't actually have a city on it, so I'm not sure if it'll sell or not. But yeah, so well, what else is in here? Oh, okay, yeah, these are always, I sell all these out. The George Foreman things. I sell every one of those out, so so they always sell for me. Not for a lot. I think I usually list them at twelve ninety five with free shipping. I think. So, all right. What do we have here? This was this was at the niche. This was a a bag sale. I think it was three dollars a bag. Dinosaurs. And things, dinosaurs and things, a game of dinosaurs from beginning to end. Multi-level play, whatever that means. I guess there's different boards in it for playing. I don't know, but uh, I didn't. I don't know if it's complete. I think it is. I'm pretty sure. And I think this was one of those ones that you have to wait on your buyer. I mean, I'm I'm not positive, but. Uh, I don't see multi-level. No, they're just all sitting down there. Maybe it means multi-level as they go through the through the pages, periods or something. 
I don't know, but there it is, so. And I know it sells. I don't know how fast it'll sell, but I know it sells, so. That works for me. Let's see, I'm gonna put this over here. Oh, underneath that. I haven't gotten to all the stuff that, I haven't listed all the stuff that I had in my last haul video yet. I know, bad, bad. This is just a Mancala game. I just got it to take over to the shop. So it was a buck. Well, it wasn't even a buck. It was in in the bag sale from the net. So it was $3 for a bag. And I got all the stuff in this. Not the stuff that's in here in the green bag, but all the stuff in this trash bag. So uh, I definitely really can't lose money on that. I just took it. I'm just going to take it over to the shop and put two or three bucks on it. Trivial Pursuit. I uh, had somebody coming in asking for, I've had a couple people now come in and asking for the disc, the Trivial Pursuit cards. They want them for uh, teaching. It was with two teachers. They're both teachers and they were looking for this kind of stuff. So I'm not going to ask a lot. I'm going to take them over there. to the, They'll go to the shop. and uh, I, Unless they do good online, but I don't think so. But uh, I'm just gonna take them over there, and I'll, I'll probably, I'll probably put, you know, well, if I put two bucks a piece on it, that's double what I paid for the bag. So I might just do that and just get, you know. All right, and then this was there too. It was uh, I, I don't know. Some of this stuff looks like it might be older. Uh. South. I don't know if it is. I don't know. This thing is cool. I mean, this this little this little thermos thing. I don't. I mean, I don't know if it's, I don't know if it's old, but it's cool. So this little small stuff. Some of these they gotta be good. What are they? They. Hold on, man. I gotta open that bag up and see what. It, I didn't want to, but I want to look at the bottom of these and see if I can find. It. No, there's there's no marks on that one. Nothing on the back, nothing on that. Doesn't, the plastic doesn't feel right. What about this one? Nope, no marks on that either. But these old guys, I think, I think, uh, G, G, like, I think these are, yeah, 1974 Geobra. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, I think these, these might be good. It's not broke, but it's missing a head thing there. I don't, and I don't know if all, if that's what this stuff is or not. It, it could be. I mean, it might. They might go, go with. They, they seem to be the right size. See, you know, see what I'm saying? They seem to be the right. Like they go with. Maybe they do. So, I have to do a little research on that stuff. This is what I was. No, no marking on it. I thought maybe. I was thinking maybe they might be marked. They might be uh, Renoir or or uh, marks or something like that but not so much there's Minnie Mouse she's a little beat I wonder if she went on an, on a pencil she might have gone on the top of a she might be a pencil topper but anyway so there's a little miniature little teapot in there it's broken so that's going to go in the trash um, we'll see We'll see. I like smalls. They don't take up much room, and sometimes they bring in a lot of money. Money. Sometimes. All right. What's uh, what's in here? I'll bring this out first. Bag of Legos. I think they're Legos. Yeah, they're Legos. They all look like Legos, yeah. So that was, I just threw that in the bag. Um, again, it was $3 for the whole bag, so I just threw it in there. And I think I'm just gonna throw, probably, I'll probably just throw these in my son's stuff upstairs. Cause he won't play with them anymore, but eventually he's gonna have kids, I think. And they're gonna wanna play with Legos, cause I think Legos will endure. Alright.
Fisher Price kid threw it in the bag. And this, I think I've had these before. I, I don't remember. I think I've had them. I don't remember if I sold them or not, though. I think it. Oh, sorry. I think I did. I, I don't know what they are. There's a little, there's a little wizard in there. You see a little wizard? A little. Uh, there's a little a knight. It's some kind of a medieval thing. It looks like this was a castle. There's a dragon head in there. I, I don't. I don't remember what these are called, but they shouldn't be too hard to find out. I'm pretty sure I had a bunch of this stuff before and I sold it. So they fit in the bag. So they fit in the bag. All right. So there's that. And that bag's that bag's kind of plastic bag. I'll use that for trash down here. This is empty. Okay. So next, uh, what do we want to do next? Yeah, we'll do we'll do this bag. We'll do this. I don't know why I bought it. It's a unicorn. It's a unicorn. It's on a wooden plaque. It was clearanced out, so it was thirty nine cents. Uh, there's some scratches on it. Somebody told me that these old wooden things. These are like from this like shop classes or something or, or whatever from back in the I think 70s maybe maybe 80s I don't know but somebody told me that these that these were getting some sale that they were selling so I, I don't know we'll see we'll see and I grabbed this because Noah's Ark stuff does good around here they usually usually it'll sell so just a little little Noah's Ark thing. And then, have I got news for you. I only bought it again because it's one of these. Well, this was 93 cents. It was half price. It was 50 cents. His pink was half price that day. So it's a little koala bear. That stuff was big back in the 70s on posters and stuff. I don't know if, what, you know what era that is. but And I grabbed this because this was, uh, I think that was clearanced out too. So it's just a little piece of cast aluminum. The last piece I listed, something like this, I listed it for like five bucks and sold it like right away. So I figured I'd grab it. Oh, 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 what's that? Oh, okay. And I grab these. They're, they're Moo Moo's, Mary's, Mary's Moo Moo's. They're 79 cents. I think they might have been all right, but I don't know. But they're neat, so I grabbed them. Cause uh, sometimes I'm just crazy. So there's those two. And I sh this is just—it's an old cat. It's a cat. Uh, it's pottery. I, I'm not sure. I think I'm not sure if it's a vase, a bud vase with a flower one in there, or. If it's a pencil holder or I forget I did used to know what that what what that type of stuff was I just I don't remember anymore I've forgotten more stuff than I think I knew all right got rid of that get that out of the way get this beautiful artwork out of the way Now, all right, so, all right, let's see, here's what we got here. I grabbed this because I bought some other Southwestern uh, Burwood stuff a while back, and I have them listed, but they sell better if you have the set. This completes the set, so I have to redo the listing and add this in. All right, and then it's a thermo ThermoServe mug, plastic mug. 99 cents Pittsburgh Steelers and it's got some scratches and stuff but I almost I I'd, I'd, I'd be hard pressed to think that it's 1976 somebody's going to want that Okay this I grabbed this it's you know it's a it was it was 2 bucks I'm going to take it to the shop I have little clips I'm going to hang on it and I'm going to 
hang things from it. So not ties, I'm not gonna use it for ties, but I probably could just sell it as that, but I'm gonna use it for displaying other things over there. Small things that would look nice hanging. And this is a Pyrex, Pyrex um, Cruet. It's a Cruet from a oil and vinegar set. And I, I think I got, I got both pieces. Well, there's the salt and peppers as well, same things. They're a little dirty. Hopefully that comes clean. Uh, but the, you know, there's a little loss on that gold there. A little bit of loss on the gold there. But these, these, if these aren't any good with that gold loss, the, the, the little cappers, or little caps are always good to, for ones that you find that are good that don't have those. Okay. And here's the other cruet. And the gold is good on those, so on the cruets, so they're gonna, they should do okay. Uh, the price was right, so. The price was right. Put that over there for now. Okay, next. Get rid of that, get rid of that. And we'll come over here to these. What do we have in here? Books. My Bible, friends. I used to be able to sell this set for a hundred dollars. I got them at Goodwill. Uh, pink. I, I think I paid a dollar. I think I paid a dollar twenty-nine a piece for them. Um, I didn't realize the price had dropped on them, but I'll still, I'll still, I'll. St I mean, there's ten of them, so I think the prices was were around fifty, fifty or sixty somewhere in there, uh, plus shipping. So. The, so I'm not gonna sell them for less than that because I know there's a buyer for those All right And let's see This is the this is it's just a napkin holder I guess for from the red caboose I believe it's red caboose in red caboose lodge red caboose lodge in Strasburg PA that is uh, a big um uh train it's a big train town that's their claim to fame is the trains trains i guess so that i think that's that should be a good i should be able it's a box so i'm pretty i'm gonna put that online i think and see see where that goes but i'll look it up and see if there's a ton of them i might i don't know we'll see but that's something i didn't look up because it should be good all right, and then I grab these. I got this one. I got these three in this series. My kids like these books. Um, they read them all. There's a fourth book. If I can get the fourth one, I should be able to... I'll kill it on these, but I paid a, uh, two bucks a piece for them, I think, or unless they were on sale. Might have been a buck a piece which I hope they were, and uh, I can't lose money on those even for the three, but with the fourth one, if I had the fourth one, I, I, I'd be I'd be golden, so. All right, Farm Journal's Country Cookbook. It's not a big seller, but uh, it'll it'll make some money for me. Paid, I paid a uh, dollar, 99 cents? I think it's 99 cents for those. All right, next. Next in the big box here, we got from the Goodwill store, we got uh, Microsoft. Uh, it's a, it's a, a power cord for, I think, I think it's the power cord for the, the, just the original Xbox, I think, isn't it? I don't think it's for the 360 or after that. I don't know. Um, I'm not a game, much of a gamer, so... Like I said, the only thing I play is Skyrim on my laptop, so I don't really know for sure. I actually have a, I have an Xbox 360, but I got it for the kids years ago, and they used it for a while, but uh, I don't use it. It's still hooked up, but I never use it. Um, Dino Dancing Barney. Barney. They were... 
Uh, where'd I get the mat? I got the mat. I got the mat. So let me look here quick. Um, I got them at Goodwill. Goodwill, so they were they were 50 cents a piece. There's these four. I just sold my big lot of Barneys, and I, I did all right with them. So uh, I thought, well, as long as I'm not too greedy on them, I should be all right. All right. Liberty Bell, this is a big one. They're usually smaller than this. This was this was a buck. They're usually smaller. Kind of pretty. Not really. <laughs> Not really. Um, these, I think these sell online. But I'm going to take it over to the shop. Because I have one over there now, a smaller one. But they usually sell sooner or later. Alright, I bought this bag of... I bought this bag of goodies little goodies because there was there were some Wade figurines there's pin that pink bunny rabbit and there's a little turkey so it was uh how much does it got on it it was a dollar 29 so I bought it just just for those but there's other neat little possibilities in here I don't know what's here there's we got these eggs I bet you I wouldn't be surprised to find to see that I could probably sell at least that metal one there, I wouldn't be surprised to find out I got I could get a buck for that. And then this is a little plastic egg. I don't know what's in there. Is there something in there? Yeah, it opens up and it's empty. Uh, I'm thinking candy was in there. That's probably trash. Okay. And then here's a little McDonald's thing. It says smile. I don't know if it's McDonald's or not, but. Look at this cute little, this cool little, we got, I don't know what these are. Do you know what these are? There's a little, I don't know if that, is that a pelican? I don't, I don't know what, they're little plastic, they feel plasticky. And this is a lizard, same kind of deal there. And then another lizard, and uh, I'm going to say hedgehog. I think it's a hedgehog. And I don't know what they are. I don't know what they came out of. But they were in this little container. Maybe they're from Happy Meals. I don't know. And then also this little troll. Little troll was in there. Little he's a little little got a little he's a little charm. Not a little charmer, a little charm. Trolls. Uh, troll. Ooh. Okay. And miniatures seem to be doing all right. All right. So, and then of course, found it. Seventy-nine cents. I bought it. And hopefully, it's not cracked. I looked at it in the light pretty well, but the cracks in these things, they they hide. They hide. If you don't hit them just right in the light, you won't see the crack until you got it home. Alright, what's next? This is... It's a cord for an Xbox 360. Just a regular cord. I don't know. I don't think I need it. There's one of these. Little uh, Corningware, Hollyberry. I think I have more of them somewhere. So if I have a group of them a lot, I'll be able to do alright. And I grabbed these saucers, red red saucers, because you saw in the last video, I got a bunch of red red mugs. So uh, now I got some red saucers to go with those mugs. Hopefully they're the right ones. They're different, but or at least similar. All right, what's next? Hey, another Polaroid camera. This was five bucks. I got this at the niche. And, uh, it doesn't power on, but that doesn't mean anything. There is battery. There is a tape to, tape thing in it. So if I ever get around to figuring out how to how to make how to do that, I bought this stuff to make a to make a uh, to make a make the batteries work. I bought this stuff to use to make the batteries work. I just haven't I haven't tried it yet. That there next 
Cuddy Sark Scott's Whiskey. A little pitcher. I won't put a lot on it, but uh, somebody will buy it. This was... Alright, this was in a... Uh, this little farm fresh tools with the cow on it. The, these were in a, a $3 bag from the niche. I got two... Did I get two... I got those, were in the $3 bag. I got this was a display. I'm, I bought this for a display at the shop. That was in the bag. This little lantern. Uh, the, these people buy them. They're not, they're not really cool, for, very good for actual lamps, but people buy them. So as long as they're cheap, I put five bucks on that. And, and then I'll get it. And then a couple more of these little things. I just got them for display. Farm Fresh blueberries. They won't be for sale. I'll just I'll use them at the shop. Unless somebody wants to buy them. And then I grabbed these. The, uh, the U.S. Capitol, Washington, D.C. Um, Silburn. Silburn, Inc. 1958. I don't know if you can read that, 1958. I've sold similar things in the past. It could have just been the content that was on them, but I I remember selling something like this. It was round, and I got like 30 bucks for it. So I figured, well, three bucks a bag. I'll just stick them in the bag because I would have paid three bucks for those those things. So I'm not even gonna sell them. So so I grabbed those take with all right and then this was this was there and uh, it, this is cast aluminum it's just a home cut one so it's not super old but it sh they should it should do all right and this one was in there as well so that stuff will do all right I'll sell those and then these guys were in there little plastic birds uh, seagulls I guess and they are they burwood um, home co made in USA that's the beautiful thing about home co they got some made in the USA stuff oh uh, this is yeah home co copy it doesn't say burwood on them but I, I'd almost almost have to guarantee they are but yeah they're neat Somebody will buy those too. Okay, now these guys I got at the Goodwill. Owls. Owls. Owls tend to sell okay. They're only a buck a piece, so uh, they just hang on a wall. I don't know what they're made out of, like a some kind of resin or something. Somebody had these. What are they? Command strips or something on them? I hate them things. They're probably good, but anyway, so. Uh, they're just gonna go to the shop. I don't. I'll look them up, but I'm pretty sure they're just gonna go to the shop. Okay, next. This I just got. I just did a listing on these, and I got more crayons. I might have to change my listing. They were seventy nine cents. The totes worth seventy nine cents. So, um, I'll just. I don't know. I haven't sold the other ones yet that I have in the listing, so maybe I need more in that listing, make it heavier, and make it worth somebody's while more to melt, melt them down. All right, and then these guys, these were sitting on the shelf at the Goodwill. It's just a couple little figurines, boy and a girl, she's making this snowman, he's skiing missing something and on the bottom it says gobble and gobble is not what they used to be this one's from 1999 so obviously it's not old or nothing like that but they are kind of collectible yet this is says bertha hummel but obviously not when these came out 1999 she's already long dead um so not really from her but uh yeah so they're still kind of collectible though, so I could probably sell them at the shop if I can't get anything from online. 
All right, and then these were, I got these at the niche books. Fun with our friends. If you're familiar with selling children's books, you know what these are. They're Dick and Jane books. They used to be really great. Dick and Jane used to be really great. Not so much anymore. And there's a second one. Here's a different fun with our friends, different cover anyway. This is a primer and they're both primers. This is, I don't know what the difference is. Maybe a different year, discard. Uh, let's see, stories, what do we do? The hat, Sally and Billy. Let's see what's in here. The hat, I think they might be the same. They might be the same. Not that it matters. And then this is another one, uh, the new days and deeds, new basic readers. They, they, they still sell. And for what I paid for them, I paid a buck a piece, a buck a piece for those. And these two, uh, landmark books. Uh, I sold a lot of landmark, bo landmark books back in the day. I don't know if these are going to be that great, but I'm going to, I'm just going to put them in a lot and sell them. I used to sell them individually. Now I'll sell them in a lot. I have some other ones, so I'll just put them together and see where that takes me. All right, next. I'm still a sucker for Miss Reed. I used to sell a lot of her books. Uh, I don't know anymore so much. No, they usually sell. Not for what they used to sell for, but they still sell. All right, and then I grabbed... They were a buck a piece for a bag of, you get four records, so they're a quarter. And they, they were all in these plastic bags. It seemed like they were taken care of. They got their sleeves. They're all these 45s. George Michael, REO Speedwagon, uh, Sheena Easton Strut, uh, Madonna's. I don't remember that one, Angel. I don't remember Angel. I don't remember Angel from Madonna. All right, and then there's a bunch more. There's the Cover Girls. Never heard of them. I don't know who they are. Cover Girls. Howard Jones. I remember him. Cool in the Gang. Celebration. We gon' celebrate. We are the world. Duran Duran, save a prayer. I don't know if I remember that one either. All right, next. There's David Lee Roth. He's just a gigolo, and everywhere he goes, people know the part he's playing. Paid for every dance. Uh, the Bangles. It's just another Manic Monday. The Moody Blues, Your Wildest Dreams. The Psychedelic Furs, Pretty in Pink. Hey, cool. The Psychedelic Furs, all right. It's got the Pretty in Pink on both sides. Oh, that's interesting. The dub version and whatever. I have to, well, I can't listen. I don't know what the dub version is. CZ Top, Sleeping Bag. Somebody bought the psychedelic first. How cool is that? All right. Hands Across America. Voices of America. I don't remember that. Tony Basil. Oh, Mickey. That's the only thing she did, isn't it? Oh, Mickey, you're so fine. That's it, I think. Uh, Home Sweet Home. Motley Crue. I don't remember Home Sweet Home. Red hot, red hot, to the top we are red hot. Yeah, but that's an old song. That that shouldn't have been on a 45. I didn't think maybe Jack Wagner. Uh, Jack Ra Wagner. Y'all remember Jack Wagner? Um, um, Felicia and uh, Frisco, General Hospital, Survivor. The search is over. The search is over. Is that the one? You're with me all the way. Da -da -da. That might be it. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Roger Daltrey. I like Roger Daltrey. 
I liked him best in Highlander the series, though. Fitz. Um, the Dream Academy, I don't know them. Well, there's five of them in this one. Rick Springfield is Jesse's girl. David plus David, welcome to the boom town. I don't know that. Cinderella, nobody's fool. Don't remember that one. I remember Cinderella, I don't remember that. Don't remember the song. And there's so there's another bunch of another batch of records. There's Madonna again. Crazy for you. I remember that one. And Brian Adams, Heaven. Tender Love, Force MD's Crush Groove. Never heard of it. ZZ Top's Rough Boy. Ario Speedwagon. There's a bunch of them in there. There's. Yeah, there's a lot. I should be alright with those. I hope. Well, for a buck, a quarter piece, I'll take them over to the shop and I'll, I'll sell them. I'll try to get a buck a piece first. Or maybe more. But I'm going to look each one of them up and see if there's any interest in them. Because a lot of them are picture, they're picture sleeves, so they sh they might have some. Do they know it's Christmas time at all? Uh, hey, little girls, is your daddy home? Did he go and did he go away and leave you all alone? I got. Oh, must be bringing. Is that Springsteen? I got a bad desire. Ooh, I'm on fire. Flamethrower, the Jake Isles Band, Bruce Springsteen's War, and a bunch of other ones in there. Okay, what else next? Next is this cool little piece of pottery. It looks kind of worn, looks kind of rough. Oh no, there it is. It's not chipped. The handle on the spoon is cracked. It was repaired, and that just looked really old to me I tried looking it up I couldn't find uh, some of this stuff was worth quite a lot you can see I paid a buck for it woohoo it looks pretty old not positive I'm pretty sure I did find that some of it was pretty good so but I did not find this so we'll see We shall see. Next. Little piece of boopy glass. Booper. Booper. I have some more of that around somewhere. And then I grabbed these Fire King. Fire King bowls because they had them in one big lot. Five bucks. So they're, you know, a buck and a quarter a piece for, there's four of them. And I thought, well... People are still ch still chasing. Sometimes they still chasing these some of these pieces, these piece old pieces of flameware. So uh, I grabbed them. All right, next. Let's see if I can get these out of the way. There. All right, next. Next is really next is this. Just a big box of Lincoln Logs. Um, they're, I'm sure they're modern. I'm sure they're not like older ones. I paid four dollars for the box of Lincoln Logs. I think I should do all right with them. Uh, if you know anything about Lincoln Logs, you're welcome to tell me about them. But I think I should do okay with those. All right, next. Let's see what else did I have? I have this down here. I think I don't think I don't think I showed any uh, this is just a it's a pencil box I think but I had these two decks of cards in here so uh, they're new so and where did I where did I get these at I got them at Goodwill they're $2.99 um, three bucks I figured it's not an, it's not old so I don't know. I'll check the cards and see. This is uh, a rival crock pot bake in something thing. It was a buck. It's just this. The other little metal piece that goes with it. 
isn't here. But I guess you set these down inside a crock pot and you, you, I think they use them to bake bread in or something. Yeah, bed and, bed, bread and something. Bread and, bread and cake. Ooh, cake. Yummy, bread and cake. Uh, so, I, I'm pretty sure those, those, those sell. Those do sell. I don't know for how much, but I know they'll sell, they'll, somebody will buy it. What do we got? All right. This was at Goodwill. Um, of course, with Goodwill's thing, they put this piece in one section of the store, and they put this piece in a different section of the store. So a dollar twenty-nine and ninety-nine cents. I had to pay for each piece of an item that goes together. So it's an amber fairy lamp, and I'm just gathering these things up because I'm. St stupid <laughs> now sometimes they do sell okay so um and i really think all that stuff's gonna come back around anyway so if it doesn't come out you know oh this was pretty good i think i paid i paid six dollars for these they are are they expired nope not yet not expired and uh i forget i forget what that sells for I don't remember, but it was, it was, I think it was a good one. I think it was, I think it was a pretty decent one. So. All right. And then from the Disney, from, I guess this is from the Disney store. Is it from the Disney store? Ten bucks. It just says Disney. It doesn't say Disney. Yeah, Disney store EU. Disney.com. I don't know. It's Tigger. It's Tigger. I love Tigger. And there's Dumbo. Same kind of deal there. They were, uh, they were 99 cents at at, uh, at the Goodwill. 99 cents. So I, I grabbed them. And I'm going to put them back in the bag here. Put them over here. I just sold a little bit of plush this week. All right. And then I got these. I think they're vintage. Berkshire. I don't I don't think Berkshire makes, makes uh, nylons anymore. And these are Queen. Queen, is that, I hate to use, is that a larger size Queen? I, I don't know, but I hope it is. Anyway, so 2002. Maybe they still, I don't know, maybe they do still make them. And then there's Hanes Silk Reflections. And this is uh, size EF. I don't know what that means. You, if you don't mind telling me, I'd appreciate that. Uh, I can look it up, though. It's not a big deal. So, there's 69 cents at the Goodwill. So, And I, I don't think that this is the color. So it's not this color. It's this color. Sandalfoot? Is that the color? No, little, little color? I don't know. Thigh highs. So they're not pantyhose they're they're I don't they're not pantyhose because there's no panties I don't know anything about it honestly I've sold some of this before because my wife listed it I got a bunch of it at the you know, I got a bunch of it at uh, at the niche one time in a five dollar bag sale and my wife listed it for me and so she knew all that stuff so now it's on me because she's done with that whole thing oh all right and I got this. I hope it's complete. I picked it up because even part of it, if I part it out, I'll make mo I'll make money on it. Uh, if it's not in that great a shape, as long as there piece some of the pieces are in it, it's the Clue Master Detective. And uh, in the past, it has been a very good game for me. So um, yeah, the first one I got, I sold for eighty dollars, something like that, which is a very good game for me. That was a long time ago, so I don't know if they still do that. Alright, oh, what do we got down here? Uh, well, I think I might have already gone through this. Yeah, I think I already did that. I did that with that already. Pretty sure, not positive. And then this. A big giant tigger. Big giant tigger. Uh, again, he was only he's only 99 cents at my Goodwill, so... Um, 
Tigger is a wonderful thing because their tops are made out of rubber and their bottoms are made out of springs and they're bouncy and they're pouncy and they're fun, 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 fun. So um, he will probably end up at the shop and he will go to some little child for probably five bucks. I'll see how they how it is, but probably. He'll make a beautiful Christmas present for somebody. I hope. All right. Uh, yeah, Domino Rally. I used to, I used to sell these pretty regular. This is a newer one. It says classic. Um, I paid a buck for that. I think I. Where did I get that for a dollar with that sticker? I don't remember what. Uh, where do I get them for with that sticker at? I forget. I don't know. Okay, then there's that, and then. Uh, did I go to a yard sale? Is that where did these come from? These were yeah, it was a yard sale. But where was it? I don't know, but they had these these monster trucks, so uh, I don't know how well they sell online, but they're good for probably a buck or, buck or piece or whatever at the shop. So, and then there's a bunch of little little things here. There's a bunch of Mario things and and these other little figures. There's a Batman, looks like a Lego dude. And this little thing here, these were a quarter. And that's what that other bag was a quarter. Oh, it was a church sale. That's right, I went to the church sale, the Baptist church sale in town. That's what it was I got there. That's funny, I, I got there, What I went to the Goodwill that day and I wasn't going to even do that. And I ran into one lady down there I see and she's telling me about the Baptist church sale she says you gotta go you gotta go to the Baptist church sale you gotta go so I did I went and uh, I got these things there I was I didn't even, I'd forgotten about it I wasn't gonna go and there's Ninja Turtles so grab them and this dude I think he's Cobra isn't he Cobra it looks like a Cobra thing on there so I don't think it's Gojo I don't think it's a, I don't think he's a Joe uh, and then Ninja Turtles, so those look like two decent Ninja Turtles. That's a crappy little, little dude there. All right, bag of cars. This is uh, Hot Wheels. It looks like a decent one though. And um, why did I get these cars? There's only a quarter, so I grabbed them. Um, I usually can get, I usually can do okay with some of the, I'll take them at the shop and I'll, there is some collectors around who pick up the loose ones, as long as I don't price them for very much, but you know, if I pay a quarter for that bag, that bag lot of them, and then I, you know, I price them all at 50 cents a piece, I'll be alright. And then I grab this dude, I don't know who he is, but he's cool looking. Do you know who he is? Here, I'll rip this thing off and you can take a look at his face. He probably isn't anything. Oh, he's a Transformer. Okay, he's a Transformer. He's more than meets the eye. Got it. And I don't know if he's broken. Looks like his pieces are all there. I'll see. I'll look it up and find out on that. Now that I know he's a Transformer. Alright, uh, more cars for a quarter. No Johnny Lightnings, they didn't, they didn't leave any Johnny Lightnings in the thing by the time I got there. I was surprised any of those cars were there when I got there. I got there really late. It was probably, it was after 12. And I got some brownies. <laughs> they were really good brownies too. All right, um, really super moist, they were good. More cars, let's see. No Johnny Lightnings. Matchboxes. 
Hot Wheels. That black one, what is that black one? That's good, it's just a matchbox. All right. And then there's a couple of, I got this bag, it was a quarter. This is obviously gonna be, it's not, I don't think it's Woody's hat in there. I think it's his, I think it's his girl's hat. I think that's what that is, the, the girl, the hat. I don't know if that's any good or not. I got the bag though for this. A uh, little armored vehicle. This one is wheels bent, but this one is a 1973, and I think it's probably actually an older, an older one. So it looks like it. It looks like an older one. Feels like an older one, and I had it. I had this one when I was a youngin. I had that one, so it's probably an older one. Alright, there's a bag. And this, let's see, okay, wait, hold on, hold on. Uh, that. And that. Those I bought to go with the ones that I have to like, I get a big enough lot to sell them. This Present Darkness, I'm just saving copies of these till I get enough of them and then I'm going to sell them in a lot. And uh, somebody will want them for a Bible study class, and they'll so they'll have one for all their students. So uh, I'm just gathering them up and saving them for that. Get them together. All right. Then we have these are Corning Centura. I just I grabbed them because they, everything was like a quarter. They're all cheap. Uh, I don't know if this if this is any good. Or not with it with it looks kind of kind of worn, but it's Corel, but it looks kind of worn. There we go. All right, and then these ones again are Corel. The the pasta bowls I had good luck with them in the past. I haven't had any for a while, but uh, hopefully they'll be good. Okay, what else? This is the one that's gonna get you got me this is what I got at the church sale okay I paid $35 for this y'all can tell me if I did all right it's a Nintendo 3ds I paid 35 bucks um, there's nothing in there uh, it's purple and I don't think I didn't try it. Looks like the power power thing came on. Doesn't seem broken. Oh look, it works. At least that part does. I don't know anything about. I I have no idea what to do with this right here. I have no idea. Uh, how to play any of this. I'm going to turn it off. So, that works. There's the power the power cables in here. Uh, there's a pack of styluses right there. So no, there's no games in here. Then, these were in there, in the box. I don't think these go to it, though. These look like they. Do they look like they go to an Apple, to a maybe an iPod or something, or to a? I know that the new iPhones don't use don't have one of these, but but um, yeah. So I just stick that in there, and then this was the Nintendo 3DS. I don't know what's what's in here in this bag. Uh, okay, it's a cord, it's another, it's a charger for the car with some cords for it, I guess, for this. I don't think, I don't know, are they the right cords for it? This one is, let's see. Yeah, I guess so, yeah. I guess that one does have the correct one there. So there's two, two car chargers, there's... 
Whatever this thing is. I don't know what this is. Something maybe to... I don't know. I don't know what that is. There's another stylus in here. And then there's all these games. All these games came with it. 35 bucks. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33. 33 games. 35 bucks. Did I do all right? Here, we'll see the games. Uh, this is not... Star Wars... Star Wars 3. Lego Star Wars 3 is in there. Obviously, oh yeah, here it is. Clone Wars. This is. Oh, it's from GameStop. So that's a, that's a thing. All right, then. Track Attack. Yep, games in there. Track Attack. NASCAR Unleashed. Yep, games in there. Planes, Disney Planes, 3DS, games in there. Uh, Crosswords Plus, yep, games in there. Monster 3D, yep, Monster 4x4 3D is in there. No booklet. Super Mario 2, I might have to... Learn how to use a 3DS just so I can play Super Mario. I don't know how to get this in. Oh, duh. It goes in like that. Silly rabbit. Alright. Super Mario. World's Best Driver Hot Wheels. Yep, that one's in there. Mario Kart 7? Is that right? Mario Kart 7? Mario Kart 7. Cut the rope. Oh! Tripping. Cut the rope triple threat. Yep, that's in there. Uh, Mario Land 3D. 3D Land. That's in there. Madagascar Karts. Must be another racing game. Because everyone knows Lions and Zebras race. Frozen. Wait, somebody paid 30 bucks for that now. Good God. Mario Tennis Open. It's in there. Oh, Mario Kart. DS, that's not for a 3DS, but you can play it. Can you play? You can play the 3DS games, or the the DS games in the 3DS, but you can't play 3DS games in a DS. That's how that goes. I remember that. That I remember from when I worked at Walmart. All right, Mario Cars 2, it's in there. Cars 1, regular cars, that's in there. Those are DS. So that's DS. The Frozen is 3DS. This is, that's DS. That's 3DS. So, okay, so that's, this is DS. Alright, cool. Alright, what do we got here? Wipeout, this is 3DS. Yep, Wipeout, Wipeout 3. Wipeout 3. Angry Birds Trilogy. Yep, it's in there. Steel Diver. That one sucks. Nobody buys that one. I don't know if it sucks or not, but I've, I had it for a long time. But it didn't have a case with it, though. Phineas and Ferb. Across the Second Dimension. What, what, what was supposed to go in there? I don't know. Was there something special supposed to go in there? I'll have to look it up, I guess. So, Steel Diver, Phineas and Ferb, uh, Lego, City Undercover, yep, games in there, Spongebob, Surf and Skate, Road Trip, 
and he's in there. 35 bucks. I paid 35 bucks for all this. Uh, 90, 90s crazy bones. Go, go crazy. Pull the cray button. Push the cray button. All right. Sonic Classic Collection. There it is. Sonic for the DS. Jewel 3 for the DS. That's in there. Superstar Carts. There's Shrek. And all them other people in there. Oh, there's the Hot Train Your Dragons in there. And it's in there. I did that one already. I did that one. I did that one. There's Lego City Undercover. The Chase Begins. Yep, there it is. That's for 3DS. Pull these out. Scribble Knots. Scribble Knots. Nintendo DS. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. 3DS. 3DS. Lego Battles Ninjago. I can't believe that this was here. That it was still at that church sale. This should have gone... Don't you... Don't you think it should have been gone? It should have been gone like first thing. Monster, Monster Jam. Yeah, what what goes in there? Well, that was it for those. So, I think I did all right with those. I think. I don't think I'm gonna be selling them as a lot. I think I did okay with that. You can tell me though if I did all right, because I really don't know. I mean, I've sold some 3DS, not much. I'll tell you what I did do when I worked at Walmart. Well, I shouldn't tell you. When I worked at Walmart. I got, uh, or no, it was right after I quit. It was right after I, I think it was right after I quit. No, I was still working there. Uh, the 3DS was relatively new. And I went in and I bought six of them. Nine of them, something like that, at Christmas time. And I got a $50 gift card for each one. I sold each one of them on eBay for more than what I paid for them at Walmart. Not much more, just a little bit more, but I got to keep all the gift cards. So that was cool. I'm not sure. I don't think I was, I'm not sure if I was still working there or not. All right, next. I had a lot. I had a lot of stuff. Okay. So. I thought it was neat. I just thought it was neat. It was $3. I couldn't resist. It was just neat. Uh, big, old, that big old 70s flower power on it. Alright. What's in here? It's heavy. Whatever it is. It's really heavy. And it's a frog. I think these are, I don't know who made these, but it's a green frog. I have two of them on eBay, so I'll probably, I'll just clean this one up, I think, and take it to the shop and see if I can get a little bit for it. That one uh, was a buck twenty-nine. Frogs are usually a pretty good seller. Mine, I have them priced really high. Probably I'm being undercut, which is what's killing me, so that's just fine. And then I bought a, a chimney. I haven't sold any of these for a while at the shop, but if I get them, if I get them cheap, I'll, I'll take it over to the shop, put three bucks on it, two fifty, something like that. It'll take a little bit, but somebody will come by them eventually. All right. And these are Red Lobster, like lighthouse glasses or something. I don't know. Uh, these, this bag was, they were clearanced. That was clearanced out for 39 cents. And I guess I got two of them. And I think I'm pretty, well, they're different, aren't they? I thought they were the same, but they're not. They're different. So that throws my whole thinking all the pieces there. Because I, I thought I saw that they were selling. 
Maybe uh, I messed that up. All right, these are little jingle bells. They were 99 cents. I'm gonna take them over to the shop and put, you know, three, four bucks on the bag. And there's some little Christmas bulbs in there for a Christmas tree. Uh, I think I'll just put them in a little plastic tote, little plastic thing in case I ever decide to pull my Christmas tree out that I have around here and see if it needs any of those. All right, what do we have in this, in this, what's in here? Oh, I just grabbed these because they were, they were clearance little, little, uh, little trivets. They're, they're not really doing anything anymore, but I like them, so. All right, next. Oh, oh. there we go. Oh, Christmassy stuff. These I got, they were a dollar at the, I got these at the yard sale shack. I grabbed them. They're just little cookie cutters. I'll just, I'll take them over to the shop. I won't put much on them. I'll just take them over to the shop. I might only put two bucks on it. And I got these at, at the, the yard sale shack too. They're, they're little owls. I just sold some owls like, like I just sold this one over there something very similar to that one so um he, i paid two bucks for the bag so the some of these bigger ones i'll probably put i don't know four or five bucks on and and uh go from there we'll see how it goes i don't know not sure not sure really what i'm gonna do with those these were at where did i get these at church sale these came from the church sale yeah these both came from the church sale david addings uh and, and they're they're i'm pretty sure they were good i'm pretty sure they were good all right this came from this came from the niche i think i don't know why i just i just one dollar for pirate mug and then you know I needed this. I had to have one of these. All right, and then I have some of these over at the shop already. These little they they seem to sell going into Christmas time. They're Libby glass, and they have this etched winter style on them. So I I have some over there. So I'm just going to take this over. I don't. I think they're over there individually. I'm going to check. But this was. This was a $3 bag. This was a $3 bag at the niche. That's what this is. So I grabbed these. I have some of these over there, but they, they haven't, they have bought them. So uh, not recently. So I grabbed a couple of those, a couple of these, the little sherbet ones. Um, let's see. I don't know why I grabbed this little snifter. I did. I, I don't know why. But I did. Um, this I got because I, I think I thought it was I mean, I don't know. I don't know. I think uh my buddy Walt at the shop might actually need some of these, but this might, they might not be the right size. And then I got these ones. It was $3 a bag, so I grabbed them. Uh, cannon jar, that's just gonna go in, in the cannon jars. That's just gonna go in my cannon jars. I didn't get very many of them this year. I didn't, I didn't sell them. I went and I sold off a bunch of cannon jars last year. Then my wife went and bought a brand new box to do grape grapes in because we have grapevine out back, and so I felt bad. So because I sold them off, and she felt like she needed to go buy more, and so I didn't sell any this year. And then we didn't do grapes. <laughs> oh wow. Okay, I got three three of these little teacups. 
They're little small decorative ones. Uh, I think I can probably. I'm gonna put two bucks a piece on them over the shop. I should. No, I should put more on the. I should put three bucks on them. Maybe. Maybe more. I should. I don't want to drive prices down. So I'm gonna. Yeah. I don't like that driving prices down thing and undercutting people. I just don't, I don't think it's... These are uh, saucers for false graph um, uh, full cart. These are full cart plates. I don't know if they sell or not. Uh, I, I have sold them at the shop. I have some over there. I have some, some cups over there, so... I'll probably, that's what I'm going to do with those. I'm just going to try to marry those. See if I can sell some more of them that way. Okay, next. We're almost to the end. We're almost to the end. This was uh, Goodwill. Bought this a couple weeks ago. It's a Stinger. Paid $1.99, two bucks. That's, if I remember right, $20, $25 for that. Okay, and this is another, just another chimney that was 79 cents. That's a little different than the other one. That's uh, kind of skinnier. Okay, then what's this? Hey, this is the gold leaf instead of silver leaf. Little pitcher. And it was a buck. I don't know how good that is either. another can and jar I bought for the lid I bought that one for the lid again so good I have a couple of those all right and I don't know if this is any good or not I picked them up they were a dollar and uh, there's two of them here I think I can I, I think something you'd be surprised you'd be I don't want to say you will be, but I'm going to, hopefully, I'm going to be surprised. I'm going to, we'll see if they, if they sell or not. They're just, they have their own things. So, I don't know. Hey, I need to tell you to, to, I'm not telling you to buy any of this junk that I'm buying. Do not buy any of this junk I'm buying. It's solely mine. It's all mine. 50 cents, I bought at the yard sale shack. Ceramic salt and pepper shakers. Little turkeys, I need to get these priced and get them over to the shop because Thanksgiving's coming. So did you see that? Couldn't tell. There they are. Yeah, there they are. So they're neat. Uh, and I'm, I am actually going to not have them in the box. I'm gonna take them over there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put, uh, I'll probably put five bucks on them. But I'm not leaving them in the box. And then this is just a, a uh, it looks like it's a, yeah, it's a Wilton. It's, um, it's a pewter, it's pewter. And honestly, I don't think they're that great. I paid a buck for it. And it's probably just going to go in my, in my box of scrap pewter. And I'll sell it for scrap as, as. That's what I did with the last lot. I sold it for scrap, and I did pretty good with it. So, it took me a while to gather it up, though. Don't get me wrong. And then I bought these. They were a buck and a half. I gave them a buck and a half. At the yard sale shack for cookie cutters. I have a bunch of cookie cutters over there. I haven't sold any at the, sh at the shop. But there's these cool copper-colored ones. So, um, for a buck and a half... I thought we'll give it a shot. We'll we'll see. Plenty of those copper colored ones. I might I might pull the copper ones out. Oh, sorry, the copper colored ones out, and uh, yeah, I might maybe I'll try to sell them online. I don't know. I'll look at the prices and see where they're at. They're probably not doing anything. So, oh. all right. What do we got in this bag? This is it. This is. This is it. This is the last bag. There's no more after this. 
I bought a notebook. Why did I buy a notebook? This I got it. I got a goodwill. I don't know why I bought a notebook. Uh, I must have been thinking I needed to keep track of something. That's all I can figure. And I bought more cookie cutters. They were 80 cents, 79 cents. So there's more cookie cutters. It's Christmassy. Coca-Cola glass. I have one or two of these around. Hopefully these are the same as the ones I have. If they are, the one that I have, I think I only have one. I think I have one listed over there. So maybe I can just see. Now that's different. Talk on it. It's, no, it's the same. Is it the same as this one? Yeah, that looks a little, one of them looks a little bigger now. Well, maybe it's just a trick of my eyes. No, there's something wrong. Them glasses don't look this almost the same, but not not quite. Yeah, this one's definitely bigger. And then what's this? Oh, it's a palm glass. I like my palm glass. Okay, that's 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 it. That's all there is. So good. I got that done. That makes me happy that I got that done. And this I can put over there. All right, so we're good then. So that's that's my haul, and I, I'm done. I'm done buying stuff for a long time. Not. <laughs> I actually think this. There's a box right over here behind us, over this a ways, over there, that I don't think I showed you, and I'm not going to dig it out. Um because it's more stuff. But uh, I've been having a lot of fun. I've been enjoying myself and having a good time. And now I get to sit down and, and work and uh, list stuff and be happy. So that's it. And that's all there is to it. So with that, I'm going to go ahead and take off. I want to thank everybody for taking the time to watch the video. I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, uh, that's all I have to say. So uh, take care. Have a good time. Um, Holidays are coming, so be thankful if you have your family. And if you don't have your family, be thankful for the time you had them. And um, that's it. Keep listening. Bye-bye.